Hi all, Terhi Koskinen here. Today I'm playing the first time with Pepler's new collection called Along the Way. It's designed by Jen Hatfield and like the previous collections, it's amazing. It's so beautiful with so many beautiful colors and different kind of products that I really love it. Here I'm going through what I have in mind to use, some figures and stickers and lots of ephemera. There's actually two packages in this collection. One is with different kind of braces and one with different images. These are my favorite papers that I'm going to use today. I'm not going through all the papers now, but let me just say that they are really beautiful. I'm first using this uh, flower paper, lots of green and some light pink and well, really beautiful and it um, presents a lot of those colors that are, are included to this collection. And I have an idea in my head of what I'm going to do uh, today for this layout. I, I'm thinking about some kind of vertical design. Um, I actually saw once in Instagram um, this kind of design and I don't remember who did that kind of layout. Anyway, it was a mixed media layout and lots of layers and things I really adore. And um, if you happen to know who did that, I would really appreciate to say thank you for her and or him. And um, kind of, um, well, anyway, to express my gratitude for inspiring me so much. But I'm going to do this in my way, which means that I'm going to use a lot of papers and a lot of embellishments to create those layers and the design I want to do. Um, there are some more yellow and red papers in the um, pattern paper uh, from this collection, but uh, I decided to stay with these kind of light tones, so white and pink and some, some teal and other greens and really light color scheme mostly because my photograph as you see is a really hmm, there's a lot of sky <laughs> visible there which is totally blue light blue so I want that to be really highlighted for this layout so I cut out some stripes, paper stripes, and now I'm thinking that I want to add some ephemera to this layout. There are lots of these blooms and flowers and butterflies, of course, yay, um, with golden foil. And then lots of similar kind of um, similar themed pieces with, without the gold foil. And there are these lovely little girls, and as in the photographs, in the photograph there are my girls and one of our dogs that I'm going to use those little girls. Um, but in the end I'm only using one because I didn't want to add too much. And I also added that little bug, which is dragonfly. Yeah. Anyway, um, I'm going to cut out some pretty flower things to add between the layers and I didn't want to record them, uh, adding those layers because it's quite boring to see. It's just double-sided tape and adding those stripes on top of each other. Um, I also fussy cut some uh, more blooms from the paper I first used. Uh, the green one um, because I want to have some more blooms visible here and there. Um, as you see the design is really simple. It's just a lot of paper stripes, <laughs> uh, stripes and it's fun. It's so easy to use this kind of beautiful 
um, produ products, I think. You don't have to think too much. Um, what I want to do is that I'm going to add here these stickers because they are a little bit different surface. It's more shiny or glossy. Um, I don't know which is the best word. But anyway, I want to add those and also I want to add some kind of text. I first thought about using the thickers because they are really thick and that would do more layers as I want to do here. But I didn't want to add that kind of big title. I want to have those um, vertical elements, the most visible part of the layout and of course the photograph but anyway the vertical lines that photograph was taken on top of one I would go with the word mountain but it's not like huge one but it's in Lapland and I really like to be there with my girls and there were lots of um, rocks and the girls started to play with them and well it was really beautiful to be there. So, as you saw, the creating process was super simple. So, I hope you are inspired by that. And if you are, just leave a comment to the Bebelous blog or to my Instagram or anywhere so I can see your creations too. I hope you like this and I really hope you have a wonderful day. We will see you again soon. Bye!